cancer-related fatigue is a, um, a, a persistent and marked sense of tiredness that's related to cancer or its treatment. It's, it's different than what somebody that hasn't gone through cancer experiences. It's, it's really doesn't respond, it, it's not really related to a level of activity. Um, for instance, if I were to go out and run a couple of miles, I would be tired afterwards, but then I would rest and I'd feel better. With cancer-related fatigue, it's not like that. Um, cancer-related fatigue, you are tired no matter what your level of activity is and no matter what your level of rest or sleep patterns are. So it's persistent, it's, 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 it's marked, it's persistent, and it's severe no matter what you do. It can interfere with a person's ability to function within the home, to interact with friends and family, um, to carry out normal things like going to the grocery store, uh, participating in church activities, in social activities. Um, in some instances, people can't return to work because of cancer-related fatigue, so it can be very debilitating. Affects person on a, on a physical and on emotional level. Um, it can, it can cause severe depression, stress, um, and um, anxiety. So when dealing with cancer-related fatigue, it's, it's important to deal with it on, on many levels, um, not only on a physical level, but on dealing with the emotional aspects.